All right, are we ready to get started with our workout today? We are just needing a set of dumbbells and you just need something that you can elevate your feet off the ground for. Okay, it can be anything, a book. Um, I'm just using a set of weights. Okay, make sure you've done a warm up before you started and we are getting straight into it. Okay, I'm starting my timer. We are bicep curl, hammer curl. So shoulders are back, standing up nice and tall. We are changing the angle of the bicep curl, which is getting different parts of our bicep. Now the bicep's only a small muscle. So that's where my attention is focused. Okay, we're coming on to single tricep. So I'm keeping my elbow nice and close to my head. I'm putting my hand here as a reminder that this is the muscle that we're wanting to work. I prefer a split stance. You can stand whichever way you like. When we do single stuff, it works on that muscle on its own. Sometimes we have a more dominant side, changing side. Now the tricep is a muscle that we don't use in our everyday life. So we're wanting to try to use it um, and strengthen it because it's, yeah, it's not used in our everyday life and it does take up two thirds of our arm. Change sides. Elevate my feet. Like I said, you can 
use anything you have, uh, a book or anything like that. And I'm gonna step forward. Okay, so my heels are off the ground. And this is just gonna help me get a bit lower into my squat. All right, so I'm gonna grab my weight. Hold my two weights. Okay, and we're coming all the way down. All the way up. Particularly fast, coming down nice and slow. My shoulders are back. When I'm coming down to the squat position, I've still got a nice flat back, very archy. Okay, now coming the other way, and I'm lifting my toes off the ground. And we need to have deadly. So deadlift, we are hinging our feet, nice flat back, and this is tightening our hamstrings. So you don't have to elevate your feet like I do, just getting a bit deep into the muscle. Okay, reach forward. So if you're holding your weights here as well, make sure your shoulders are back. Doing well guys. This is challenging, it's meant to be challenging. You're strong enough and you can do this. Just don't give up. Okay. Now the deadlift should never pull in your back. All right, I'm done. 